Hi, my name is Rebecca Barrett, and I would like to tell you about an exciting new initiative for Ontario's primary care providers. The Centre for Effective Practice, in collaboration with the Ontario College of Family Physicians, will be rolling out a project aimed to develop and disseminate health information and clinical tools to support primary care providers like you and I. Through this multi-year project funded by the Ministry of Health and Long-Term Care, the Centre for Effective Practice will develop resources on five topic areas per year, which have been identified by you and your colleagues as areas of clinical interest that are important for effective patient care. The first of these clinical tools is the Preconception Healthcare Tool. This tool is intended to help guide your discussion of health promotion and illness prevention strategies with all individuals of reproductive age. The need for this tool is supported by strong evidence that good health begins even before conception. Hi, my name is Deanna Tellner and I will be discussing the development of the preconception healthcare tool. In order to ensure that the tool is relevant and meets your needs as a primary care provider, a working group consisting of myself, a family physician, Rebecca, the nurse practitioner who you just heard from, and staff from the Centre for Effective Practice oversaw the development of the tool. The information contained within the tool has been pulled from academic publications, grey literature, and relevant associations reports, identified through a comprehensive literature search done by Rebecca and an environmental scan conducted by the working group. The tool was also circulated in draft form to individuals and organizations with an interest and expertise in maternal and infant care and to providers who practice comprehensive family medicine in order to collect their input and feedback. The revised tool was then focus group tested in order to obtain feedback from primary care providers from a variety of different practice settings across Ontario. The resulting feedback was then incorporated into the final version of the tool. The tool is organized into three columns and 16 rows. The columns distinguish the three aspects of primary care. First, prevention and promotion. Second, screening. And third, management. The rows classify the tool content by clinical category. The design of the tool allows for its use opportunistically over a series of visits with all patients of reproductive age. The tool allows users to chart key pieces of information and have easy access to evidence, best practices, and patient resources. For ease of documentation, the tool includes a series of checkboxes so you can keep track of the clinical categories and recommendations you have already covered with your patients at previous visits. External resources have been embedded in the tool through a series of hyperlinks. These hyperlinks may be followed by a red maple leaf, which denotes a Canadian resource, a provider's briefcase, indicating that it is a provider resource, or a green patient figure, denoting a patient resource. For those using the tool in paper form, an accompanying resources and references document has been created, which contains a list of the URLs for all of the hyperlinked resources. The Preconception Healthcare Tool was created using best evidence available in 2014 and the Centre for Effective Practice will make an effort to update it regularly. We thank you for your interest in our Preconception Healthcare Tool. For more information or to download this tool, please visit our webpage. Also, please remember to check out the Centre for Effective Practice website for future health information and clinical tools to support primary care providers like yourself.